What's up everybody, it is the Big Game Hunter here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Ape Escape 3. In the last part, we fought Steve Blum, I mean Monkey Yellow, and we captured him. And we also pretty much completed part 3 of the game. Anyways, in this part, we're gonna head off into the next section of levels, which we will start with. Monkey Expedition sets off on Mount Amazing. Now, you might have noticed a bit of a theme running so far. What well, we've had so far fantasy themes and our first fight was with a dragon this is more set to American style and it ends on a Western which was mainly American uh, American themed uh, shows and we get into Japanese esque themes and it starts in monkey yellow fight which was basically set in Japan basically the levels have a set following to them I can only understand it up to here but after this I kind of get a little lost. I guess this is going to be set up as an adventure theme for adventure themed television that most people see. Maybe it is, maybe it's not, maybe I'm just thinking too hard. All I do know is this also follows the same path of having three, four, three, and then now we're going to be going into a set of four levels. But enough talking, it's time to get off into the next mission. Hey, here's another gadget. I'm going to warp over to you. It's a sky flyer. Use it to soar high up into the sky. Learn how to fly like an eagle in the training room. No. Want to go over to the train No. Room and try it out? No, get that thing away from me. No. All right, capture 13 monkeys. Easy come, easy go. Uh, let's head on in. Now this level I'm not gonna lie, I really don't like it that much. It's easy to die in a later part of, it, of this level, so... I honestly say, when you're going through this level, be very careful. Don't be like me, and easily fall off the cliff, because I think it's an instant death if you fall off, or it r takes you far back into the level. But anyway, Skyflyer, all you have to do to use this is allows us to, well, basically fly. All you have to do is spin the... The right stick around that charges it up, and then we can just glide across the sky. And I want to get those, please. I want to get all three of those, please. And you know what? Screw it. Oh crap! No! 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 All right. So what we already have one ape right here. Let's see. Collect cereal prizes. Uh, I believe that there's another one. There's one hiding in this tent over here. We'll be able to get to him since we now have, wait for it, all our gadgets. Now we just got to get all our morphs. Uh, we also got to, not you, up there, monkey. We have to use slingshot to get him. But first, we're going to capture this guy. And bam. Ukichi. Uh, can't fly up here. Please let me fly up here. You suck, game. Actually, you know what? No, it's actually a good thing I fell down here, or else I would have missed the monkey camera. I forgot to tie a lifeline! Right. No, ladies and gentlemen, tying a lifeline when going mountain climbing is actually one of the most important things to do. Because, well, if you forget to tie the lifeline to you, well, then... Fighting... Huh. Man, that camera gets some amazing angles! As I was saying, if you ever get to tie a lifeline onto you as soon as this guy d explodes... Eek! Where the hell did he go? Wow, he... that camera has really amazing angles. Darn it, and it ruined my joke. Alright, so, what monkey do we have coming up next? I believe the one in the green tent is the next monkey that we can capture. I believe I'm right, I believe I'm right, I am right. I remember right, this was also a white pants monkey, so we're gonna send our car in to spook him out. And instant capture! Probably one of the easiest monkeys to capture in the game, because he's so vulnerable when you lure him out. I hate you! Go away. I hate these things. They're annoying, especially when you fight multiple of them. Although they're somewhat easy to kill because you can just basically reflect their attacks right back at them. These things still do a lot of damage. 
Now, can I please get you? Yes, I can. Unfortunately, I can't aim that far back. There. That's why I'm sweet. Don't have a lifeline. You get knocked down easily, and that was weird. He didn't fall through with the swing. Ah, oh, well. I guess I might as well mention that this is level is basically where the game starts to actually get... The levels actually start to get a bit of length to them, because... Well, we're already five minutes in, although that was mainly my fault from piddling around in the intro in the back of the hub. But still, this is basically where the levels start to get a bit lengthy. And it's also where the real challenge of the game starts. And unlike uh, past games where the challenge sort of has like this unfair difficulty curve, this one sort of starts leaning you into it. Uh... Ooh, jeez. Ah, uh, you know what? This thing's a pain. Let's go to Wild West Kid. I usually go to Wild West Kid because it makes this section so easy. That's... That's one. You're yeah, jeez, I hate those things so much. Oh, God, it's a green pants monkey. Fall. Fall, damn it. Fall. I did not press down the stick, and yet I shot the net. Bam! Thank you! Ugh, you asshole. Uh, not the love beam. Anything but the love beam. I hate that so much. That's probably by far my most hated weapon the monkeys get. Because it basically leaves you so vulnerable. And did I die? Seriously? 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 You know what? Screw it. Wild West. Stay away from me with that stupid love beam. Now, be captured. Thank you. Die. I'm sorry if I'm being abnormally loud today. Let's just go. Smack this. I honestly don't know what movie they're referencing here. I'm sure one of my... I'm sure one of you lovely, lovely film buffs out there probably know what movie that was a reference to. If so, leave it in the comments because I honestly, for the length of me playing this game, I've never known what that was supposed to be a reference to. And I'm probably gonna get bashed because I don't know, because maybe it's like a really obvious reference and I just don't see it, or I don't know. Let's just push that in, push the blocks in, that will allow us to go to the hardest part of the stage. And so far, and the only remaining monkeys are all the way up in that next area. Yo. Uh, Yo. There we go, and going up. And we only need to capture five monkeys left, very good. And there is our first target right here, come on, come on. Good lord! Jeez! Now, welcome to why this is the hardest level in the game. Hardest part of this level. It's narrow passageways and easy to fall deaths. Uh, let's see. Well, we got one up there. One flying around over there. Another one's flying around over there. You know what? We'll hit the one up here. Uh, actually, better yet, we'll just hit get this one. Thank you! We're just missing two, and I do believe that there's another one flying around outside. I could have sworn that there were two flying around. Traumatized by Christmas presents. Wow. That? I got nothing. That's just sad. Uh, I probably have to fly up there. Going up. Oh, you little! Ah! Surprise! Son of a! Thank you. Jeez. Now where's my last victim? See, so we got one up there, but we have one over here. You know what? 
I'm surprised he says he's traumatized by Christmas presents when he's standing in front of a box, which is basically a Christmas present. And speaking of Christmas, thank you for all that money. Uh, I officially hate this monkey. This is my most hated monkey. And again, what the hell? Where am I going? Because who doesn't like Christmas? Seriously. If you hate Christmas, you have no soul. Good lord! Thank you! Finally! Jeez! Uh, tell me about it. Alright, back we go and back into the old grind. Up next is... Oh, I actually like this one. This is actually one of my more favorite levels in the game. Because of how funny it is. Alright, so with that, let's go out with the monkeys. There's a... There's a dirty joke in there I could make, but you know what? I'm not going to. I know someone in the comments is going to make it. Alright, so first victim is right here. And I said first, first victim is right here. Thank you. Jeez, you did not have to be that rude. However, but a bam! You son of a damn! Come on! Don't be back flipping around, me, boy! Oh god, he's mad! Doesn't matter. He's mine. So now, oh, we actually, oh, there's actually a monkey nearby. Might as well grab that one, and it's over here. We're pretty much chugging through this level pretty fast. And... Alright. Very good. Oh god, this video. I don't even want to tell you how much this video was uh, to me. Okay, one, two, one, two. Hey, you in the back, stop slacking off. I love the front, how the front one has a mustache. You know what? Let's return to the fantasy night. They're clumped together. Charge, man! That's one. You should have run toward. You shouldn't have run towards me either. You know what? Aw, look at that. They think they're saving a carrot. Well, you know what? My carrot! Where'd he go? Where? What? Who? Ah, there you are. Alright, time's run out just in time, actually. Was that the chicken from Ocarina of Time? Or, well, the Zelda series? Cause, or is, Every time I hear it, it's that's all what I, my mind immediately goes to is the Zelda series, because... Damn chickens! I believe that there's a monkey up here. I was right. Wow, this looks like fun. Then follow the rainbow. And with that, that place is cleared out for now. Uh, now you'll understand why I said for now and. Well, later in the game. I wouldn't say it right away, because, trust me, we've got lots, lots more of this game to cover before we're anywhere done to being done with it. So, I guess we'll start working counter- I guess we'll work clockwise, and first step is Legoland! Or, no, not Legoland, uh, Toy Block Land. Ow, ow, hot, ow. Okay, thank you. And we got a puzzle to solve. And we need our RC car. 
Alright, drive the RC car in there. Step on the switch. Step on the switch. Woo, boy! Hide. Now this is actually some of an annoying part because you gotta compensate. <sighs> of course, if you mess up once, you have to do the whole thing all over again. What the? Switch, go, turn, lit, raise, raise, hide, wait, go, stop, go, wait right here just in case, deal with you, oh for crying out loud, alright, Uh, wait, gotta step on the switch again, I believe. Yep. Because, if you pay attention down there, there is actually a monkey we catapult right up into here. Now, before we do that, we might as well grab this whole mess of times ten coins. And with that, the puzzle is finished, and you are... You are... Stop hopping like a rabbit! You are, you are a monkey, not a, not a bunny. I don't care how much how big your ears are. Ears do not make the rabbit. Now what else is in here? Up there. One's just hanging hanging out, and I can probably easily snipe that guy. Where is he? Right up there, fine on the airplane. And I don't have any homie. Oh, I actually got him. I wasn't even paying attention. I actually hit him. You are mine. Monto. We only got two monkeys left, and... Are it... Do we have two monkeys in here, or is only one? Let's see. One's right there. Ah, but it's only one. Ah. Ah, well. How do we get back up there? I believe we need our Sky Flyer, and we need to do a bit of platforming. Alright, go up, platform! No, no, not you again! Go away! Go away! Go away! No! Ow! Well, oh, well, thank you for helping me up here. Now die! I believe there's a- No, wait, no, I'm wrong. I'm, I'm misreading. There is actually another monkey up here, but we're not gonna be delving into that one till much later. Like, I don't know if I'm gonna do those monkeys as like a bonus video at the end, or you want me to incorporate it with the main story. Hell, I don't even know if you can get those monkeys to appear during the main story. Alright, so what's next? Robot Land! You know what? I believe there's only one monkey in here, so I think it's an easy capture. Alright, yep, I believe there's only one monkey in here, so let's head into our robot. And go on through Legoland! Now, this was what I remember when I thought of Legoland. Well, that's what it is! There's giant Legos everywhere. And... That's it. Now, every time since we're in a robot, that must mean there's a robot fight! Jump! Ow! No! 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 Good lord, this robot's resistant! Thank you, jeez! Out you go! And... Hello, money! Money, 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 money! Mine! Ha ha! Looking pretty good.
Very good. Thank you very much. Alright, ladies and jerks, I think that's enough time here because we're, we're well over 20 minutes, and I think you've gotten a nice long video for my return. Sorry again about the long delay in these videos, I've just been having a lot going on with me, yada yada yada, and all that stuff. So next time on Let's Play Ape Escape 3, we're gonna head off into the next world, which is... Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't like this level. Well... Anyways, next time, we'll be heading there. See you guys next time. Later.